Hello. So I am basically quarantined like all the rest of you guys. The city of Augusta has finally decided that we too should stay home and not go anywhere just for our safety so um in the meantime one of the things i've really been wanting to focus on is getting my health back right um so just a couple things i'm gonna make some tea and i finally got my bay moss sea moss See? been wanting to try sea moss for a while now and i've seen a couple of different people who have it and um, I just, I wanted to support this brand just because I've been a big fan of Black Ink for a very long time. And I saw that at Charmaine TV and her husband, Nikki Bay, finally have a product that's out. It's black owned. And I just feel like we just need to start supporting our own black and brown businesses instead of paying into these big corporations. So I'm getting healthy and I'm doing my part by supporting us and just supporting small businesses. So that being said, got my tea. I got some lemon and ginger tea. You can get it from any store, Walmart, Walgreens, whatever. But lemon and ginger tea, just because it's what I like. So I boiled some water. And I'm making a mess. <laughs> okay. Perfect. And how cute is my cup? See it? Invincible Iron Man. <laughs> It's my husband's cup, by the way. I had one of my own, but moved and got rid of it. Super cute. All right, so I'm also going to use some Mountain Ridge honey. I prefer honey over sugar in tea just because it's a preference as far as taste is concerned for me. Um, I know a lot of people prefer honey over sugar because it's healthier, but that's not really like my issue i just think honey just tastes better than sugar and tea so that get that all dissolved so one of the things that i really been wanting to get back to is my workouts and stuff um got married and ended up getting a little thicker than what i was before <laughs> And it just, you start spending more time with people that you love and you start cooking more and just enjoying things that you genuinely love outside of work, you know, when you get into a relationship. And that's exactly what I did. And my husband loves my cooking, but it's time to get back on the thick track. So here we go. So when you open the product, it is going to smell like seaweed because that's what it is. It came from the ocean. Um, I, I don't know if you can see how purple it is, but it is very, very purple is pretty cool so there's really not much to it um take a spoonful and add it to my tea about that much you can see how purple it is and just add it to my tea it's gonna dissolve and i'm just gonna drink it and that's it I've never had sea moss before, ever, so I'm really excited to see what it tastes like. Um, I've seen a lot of reviews of people that say that sea moss is completely gross and disgusting, and then I've also seen a lot of um, people in general say that sea moss doesn't really taste like anything, so if you add it to tea or smoothie or anything like that, you won't even notice the difference. Oh, it's dissolving really good. Um, you won't even notice the difference, so maybe I'll do some smoothies or something and try it out and see what it's like in there. But for today, tea was what was up. The pollen here in Georgia is awful. How do you guys live like this? Like, literally, my car is yellow every day, and I'm always sneezing. So I don't know how y'all deal with that, but I guess I'll figure it out. But tea will definitely help and kind of help open up everything so let's go let's give it a go and see i'm so excited about this all right so my video says that i've been videoing for about four minutes four and a half minutes so this should actually be good and steep because it's about two to three minutes on the steep tea bag so we'll see my tea even has a purple color to it i wish you could well, I guess it just looks black since the cup is black. <laughs> but let's see. It just smells like lemon and ginger. Hmm. 
Yummy. <laughs> I don't know what I thought it was going to taste like, but it actually is pretty good. Um, so I just, just wanted to let everybody know I am going to be starting a blog since I'm stuck inside and I can't do anything. One of the things that I genuinely love to do is cook. And like I said, I'm going to get back to working out and eating right and and just getting my health back on track because it's so important, especially when you get to your 30s. So um, please stay tuned and yeah, you guys stay safe out there. If you don't have to go anywhere, please don't go anywhere. Um, it's not necessarily saying that you are invincible, but just stay home. The sooner we all stay home, the faster this will all be behind us and we can all get back to work and life as we knew it. So that's all I have. Stay safe, guys. Bye.